Welcome to my first day in the Philippines, the motherland. Our flight was super long. It was like 30 hours in total. But alhamdulillah, we finally got to Manila, got to the airport, picked up our bags, and then Tita scooped us up. This was my very first view of the Philippines, stepping right outside of the airport doors. I have never been here before. This is my first time. My mom is from the Philippines. Pilipina, ha? Uh, but anytime my family has been able to come, I've either had school or was unable to take off from work. Alhamdulillah, 30 years later, Allah has blessed me with the opportunity to finally make it out and visit the literal motherland. I have been anticipating this moment pretty much my entire life. So this is a really big trip, a uh, really important moment for me to be able to connect with my culture in a way that I haven't been able to before. So I am ready to take in all the culture and just sort of soak up all the vibes, you know? This is us getting closer and closer to the city where we will be staying for a bit. We got to our place, dropped off our bags, and decided to go for a walk in the neighborhood to just kind of get a feel and eat up the town, you know? There are these walls of plants all throughout the city, which we love because you know we all about the green there are also cats everywhere which is adorable at this point i have not slept in like two days so i'm just trying to exhaust myself until bedtime like a two-year-old child the billboards here are freaking huge we walked around a bit more ended up at a mall i discovered a store that had traditional filipino clothing this is called the Barong Tagalog, and if you know me, I'm all about the traditional clothing, so I was crying inside. They had some traditional Filipino woven crafts. We walked around some more and literally followed the smell, which led us to Pan de Manila, which is a Filipino bakery, and I will literally die for baked goods. Any Filipino would do. I bought a bag of pandesal and some ensaymadas and had my first Inside Mada, standing in the streets of Manila. And then I went home and passed out. Good night!